There is now a facility to dispose of assets so that there is a record in the system of all disposals and they can be reported on. To enable the disposal system, click on Your Preferences on the right-hand side of the Home page and in the Disposal tab, ensure Enable Disposal is ticked. You can also indicate that only a selection of the assets require disposal based on their value. Now that the disposal system is enabled, when any assets that require disposal are deleted, they are moved into the disposal system. If we go to the office in the first floor of Block A and delete the whiteboard, you can see that it gets moved to the disposal system. To view the disposed assets, you can click on the indicator of the number of assets pending approval for disposal, or go back to the home page and select Disposal from the Manage Shortcuts. You will see a list of assets that have been deleted and are pending approval. You can tick the pending and or the approved boxes above the headings of the disposed assets to select which assets you wish to view. You are able to view the notes which will tell you who has approved and disposed of the asset and add your own information. You can cut the asset to place it on the clipboard so it can be returned to the asset register. To approve the asset's disposal, tick the Approve box next to it and click the orange Approve button below the list to confirm disposal. You will then be asked to confirm and give a reason for the disposal. To permanently dispose of an asset, ensure the Show Approved box above the asset list is ticked. The Dispose box to the right of the assets can then be accessed. Tick this and click the orange Dispose button below the list of assets to confirm permanent disposal of the asset. If you want to re-add the asset at a later date, you will have to do so manually.